Good day to you. Hope you're having a wonderful day. So this is a little update to where I read the book of Philemon or Philemon. Um, and I said Philemon the whole time. And I actually did find where um, it was being pronounced as like Philemon. And, and it sounded, you know, it had kind of a heavy accent. I can't really do it. So, you know, so Philemon was the close that I was going to be. But it appears from what I'm seeing um, on different places and from different people that either Philemon or or Philemon, you know, kind of um, a long. The Lee is the one is the syllable that's supposed to be, I think, the most stressed. And I think the Philemon comes from where the Greek letter Phi you know, we consider that P-H-I uh, for whatever reason. I'm not going to get into all that because I don't know all that. Okay. So um, I don't, I'm not sure why it would be Philemon since we have Philippians and not Philippians. But that could just be an inconsistency or that could be a difference that I'm not aware of. Just like we have differences and inconsistencies in English. So it appears that the correct, the correct, I'm sorry, correct pronunciation would be Philemon. With a with a long eye at the beginning, Philemon or Philemon. Either way, wouldn't be Philemon like I was saying. Most likely, I only found like just a couple of references to that, and uh, it appears that was probably wrong. There is a one translation that is Greek sounding again. That like I said, it, it had more of an accent, and it's not really gonna. I'm never gonna be able to get that exactly right, <laughs> and it looked kind of like. Philemon, Philemon, like that. But I only saw that once too, so that's probably probably not. Uh, well, I don't know. Uh, to my knowledge, it's probably not totally correct. So the accepted pronunciations appear to be either Philemon or Philemon, and that's that's the way people seem to say it. So I wanted to give you that update. I was not aware of that, but somebody pointed that out to me, and I appreciate that uh, because I didn't know. And there's probably a lot of these names and towns and places that I'm just killing the pronunciation of because I don't know how to pronounce them. <clears throat> so I'm just doing, you know, the best I can. Um, I don't, you know, to be, to be fair, I don't go and look everything up because that, that would just add more time and that would just keep me from, from, <clears throat> you know, from this from doing my study if I, if I go and look at everything and try to see how to pronounce everything exactly right. So a lot of what I go on is what I've either heard or maybe just like like this one. I think I was just looking at it and it just looked like Philemon to me. But, you know, obviously that was not correct. So that's fine. That's not a problem. <clears throat> it's actually a good thing. It's always good to learn. Um, like I said, I don't go look everything up to try to see how to pronounce it. Even then, if I did, there's a chance that, like with this, I'm going to see more than one way to pronounce it. And so, would I end up with something that would be perfect and acceptable to everyone? I don't know. So, uh, it's very it's very hard to tell sometimes. And I was looking this up on the web, so, you know, that doesn't necessarily mean that I'm choosing the correct flavor that's out on the web either. So... It's, it's, it can be hit or miss, but just to let you know, I'm trying to do the best I can, and I just did not, uh, I did not know that that was pronounced that way, so that's different. Um, so that's my little update for, um, I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to say the, what I seemed to, at first what I was hearing the most was Philemon, or Philemon, but then now I've heard a bunch of other people say, Philemon. So that seems to be the more popular pronunciation from what I could find. Now, of course, just because it's the most popular, does that mean it's the most correct? Maybe not, but if I say that, people will know what I'm referring to. And if, if someone absolutely has the correct answer, you can always let me know. But uh, uh, for now, I'll just go with either Philemon or, or Philemon, and we'll, we'll let it go with that. So that's my update for that. A small letter, but, uh, you know, it had that pronunciation itself, the person's name, and then Onesimus, I guess that's okay, but I I don't really know that. I was just, like I said, I was just going with it the way it is. It could be that it could be stressed differently or pronounced slightly differently. 
and then there's this archipus and different things like that in the uh, in the letter. But nonetheless, I'm going to give you an update like that. This is just an aside to the actual content. Uh, we, we don't want to get too hung up on these things, but it's nice to know how something should be said. Uh, but like I said, I wouldn't want to slow down um, reading and understanding what's really here for the sake of like absolutely pronouncing it, you know, 100% correct. Um, but then again, I don't know how that affects, you know, people hearing and listening. So, you know, it could be that if I always have it wrong, that that's going to kind of affect your listening. I don't know. So um, I will try to make sure that we at least are close on these things, but uh, there there is no guarantee. And uh, like I said, I don't know Greek, you know, and a lot of these are Greek in origin. I mean, a lot of these towns like Philippians and some of these, they are they are in Greece or in Macedonia, which is now a part of Greece. So, all right, that was it. I just wanted to do that update. I don't want to drone on about it forever, just uh, to let you know. So, thank you very much for listening. Hope you have a wonderful day. And remember, God loves you.